Hi, I'm Gail Banks. Last week, the kind folks at Duramax came back to build almost 400 engines. These are those engines. We're at Banks Tech, just down the street from Banks Power. A lot of you may not know that this business even exists. Let me tell you what we do here. This is the Banks engine assembly business. All these Duramaxes are specially built for us at Duramax in Moraine, Ohio. These are Banks D866T. These engines are built primarily for use in the new military joint light tactical vehicle. This is the vehicle that replaces the Humvee. The JLTV is a quantum leap in crew protection, in warfighter protection. I'm real proud to be in this program. These are not pickup truck engines, although they're based on the same core architecture. From the engine block down is all banks. On the back of the engine is banks. And on the front of the engine, starting with our viscous vibration dampener assembly, there's stuff that goes on these engines, which we can't show you. You might, if you're in the, in the service and you're deploying with JLTVs, which is happening right now, you might get an inkling of what the engine looks like, but it's so buried in the vehicle, it's tough to tell. If you're underneath the vehicle looking up, you'll see banks on the bottom of the oil pan, cast aluminum oil pan. So what happens at Banks Tech is we receive the base engines from Duramax. They're partially banked. Everything else that happens is banks. And more importantly, Oshkosh. Oshkosh being the manufacturer of the JLTV. Why do we have all these engines all at once? Well, we were running out of engines and GM had shut down. So I asked them, can you guys, especially the people on the line that know how to assemble the Banks engines, can you guys come in and do a week? A week worth of production there is a month worth of engines for us. I'll be damned if they didn't do it. They came in and they built close to 400 engines and shipped them out. They had to remove the pickup truck engines that were on the line, partially assembled, bring in our product, stage it, and start building. I have never worked with people who I value more and respect more than the crew at Duramax. They have been with us all the way. You know who you are if you're watching this. I'm thanking you personally, you. So when this COVID thing is over, the world's going to be different. We want our military to be prepared for anything that comes.